multiplication terms. Factor. Multiplying two whole numbers gives a product. The numbers that we multiply are the factors of the product. 5 times 2 equals 10. 5 and 2 are the factors. Product. The result of two or more numbers when multiplied together. 2 times 3 equals 6. 6 is the product. Associative property of multiplication. The product of three or more numbers stays the same no matter how the numbers are grouped. 3 times 4 times 5 equals 60. In the example on the left, 3 times 4 is multiplied first, and then that product is multiplied times 5, which equals 60. In the example on the right, 4 times 5 is multiplied first, and then that product is multiplied times 3, which also equals 60. Commutative property of multiplication. Changing the order of the numbers in a multiplication problem does not change the product or result. 2 times 5 times 10 times 6 is the same as 5 times 6 times 10 times 2, which equals 600. Distributive property of multiplication. Multiplying two numbers, factors, together gives the same answer as if you break up one factor into two numbers, multiply, and add together the products. 2 times 4 equals 8. You get the same answer if you take one factor, 4, and break that up into two numbers, 3 and 1, because 3 plus 1 equals 4. Multiply, so you have 2 times 3 plus 2 times 1, and then add the products. 2 times 3 equals 6, and 2 times 1 equals 2. 6 plus 2 also equals 8. Identity property of multiplication. Any factor multiplied by 1 stays the same. Multiplying by 1 lets the factor keep its identity. Think of the number 1 as a mirror. Any factor multiplied by 1 sees itself as the product or result. 1 times 3 equals 3. 1 times 66 equals 66 and 1 times 10,000 equals 10,000. Multiply by 10. When multiplying by 10, just add a zero to the end of the number. 5 times 10 is 5 with a zero at the end, which becomes 50. 4 times 10 is 4 with a zero at the end, which equals 40. 11 times 10 is 11 with a zero at the end, which equals 110. 98 times 10 is 98 with a zero at the end, which equals 980. Zero property of multiplication. If you multiply any number by zero, the answer will be zero. Think of the number zero as a mean number. When any number is multiplied by zero, zero doesn't let any other number be the product or result of the equation. 0 times 7 equals 0. 0 times 39 equals 0. 0 times 289 equals 0.